Uh, today I would like to show you how to uh, solve the problem of uh, moving a print bed on a Lego Neptune uh, 4 Plus. It's a new uh, printer. I had some issues with the first layer and then I find out that the bed moves a little bit up on uh, uh, from left uh, to right. So you got a uh, two uh, ranges from a Lego, the smaller one and the bigger one. Uh, take the bigger one and you need to adjust uh, the screws on the sides. Uh, they are using um, uh, V wheels and uh, rubber wheels, so you need to make them uh, tighter that the bed is not uh, moving from side to side and from up uh, to down when the printer is uh, printing. You have uh, six uh, screws that you can adjust, three on each side, but uh, you have only uh, four screws that you can uh, tighten to make uh, the bed stable. On the left side there are uh, there, there is only one screw and three, three rubber wheels and on the right side you have three screws. So the three screws, first of all you need to start from the left. You need to make sure that the, uh, that the wheels are uh, moving uh, freely and every uh, wheel uh, moves without uh, any problem. So we are on the left side of the printer you can see that there is a screw that you can adjust. You need to put the wrench there and you need to move it from left uh, to right. It's this screw, so you should see it uh, easily and you need to make sure that every wheel is moving without uh, any problems. And uh, when, you, uh, when you move uh, your bed, uh, all of them should uh, uh, move together. You can see everything seems to be uh, okay after uh, tightening uh, this uh, up. So when you are done with this side, you need to move to the right side and then tighten the right side. The same way, make sure that every wheel uh, is moving without any issues. I don't, I'm not sure that you can see it. Uh, correctly, so there are some screws. Let me let me adjust the camera a little bit. And on each side, there are three of them. You can uh, adjust it. Be careful that you are not uh, making too many rotation with the wrench because uh, a, li a small rotation is uh, enough and. When you are uh, turning it left or right, it depends if you would like to tighten it, then make sure that every wheel moves. You can see everything seems to be okay. There, is, there are no issues and the printer should work fine. So you shouldn't have any first uh, level issues. But after tightening it, you need to uh, level the printer once more time, set up uh, the Z, uh, Z, uh, Z, of Z offset once more time because uh, the uh, position of the bed uh, will change after adjusting the screws. After tightening uh, the screws, uh, the last step would be to uh, level uh, the bed. Uh, it's the same process uh, what you did after uh, starting the printer first time. It's uh, well described in a Lego uh, uh, manual. So you go to the level, confirm it. The printer is moving uh, the uh, printer head to the uh, uh, home position. So we need to wait a little bit. And then you can see there is a Z offset. You can adjust it by uh, switching uh, the, uh, the step uh, value of the Z offset and moving it with arrows up or down. And you need to uh, do this, uh, the standard uh, leveling uh, process with a, a sheet of uh, paper. And after that, you are going 
to the uh, to the uh, first manual step. So this one will uh, uh, allow you uh, uh, adjusting each screw on the each side with, with a p uh, sheet of paper, and after that you are doing the automatic leveling process. So that uh, would be everything, and after that you should uh, get the perfect first layer. Thank you for watching.